What's up, Rudy Foodie fam? <laughs> Guys, I'm so tired of it raining. It's so miserable right now. And, you know, we're at that weather right now where it's like it's rainy, but it's still humid. It's just gross. It's transition period. It's about growth, people. All right. Welcome back to our channel. Lupe here. Rody Foodie. Like, comment, subscribes if you can, guys. We are so freaking close to 2,000 subscribers. Nuts. I think we're like 20, 25. I, I can't do the math. So uh, please like, comment, subscribe, guys. Also, today we are at KF Sizzle. KFC. Here's the box that it came in. So they came out with a new $5.49 meal deal. Three uh, three bad boys, some papa fritas, little biscuit, little thing here, a sodi, and some dip dip. So we're going to get into it because I haven't eaten all day. And your boy. All right, this is what happens when I'm hungry, guys. I'm smoking uh, fry cigarettes. All right, let's get into it. I also asked them for the finger licking good sauce, right? Because I saw it online. Someone was like, hey, you got to get the meal deal. It's only five bucks and change. By the way, I don't know if it's everywhere because I asked for, I was like, hey, can I get the $5.49 cent um, three chicken or three tender meal? And she's like, yeah, the number nine. And I was like, I guess. I just lost Papa Frita out of my mouth. Uh, I was like, I guess. Uh, but the meal deal that I saw online doesn't come with a cookie. So I think that I, this is the closest thing that I got to the meal deal. So let's pretend this cookie's not here. All right. Now let's get some of these. These are kind of tiny. These are smaller than, uh, than Popeye's. All right, guys. I was really hoping for that finger licking good sauce. But that's okay. Got a little dip dip down the hatch. Oh, white meat. Mmm. Mmm. I'm here for it. Mmm. Check out the ranch. The ranch is like, I don't know if you guys can see it. It's so dark. There you go. I don't like a, I don't like a ranch that's too hard, like too, um, too hard like that. But, it's not bad. KFC's ranch is always like, uh, it has like a little sweetness to it. All right, soda test. You guys know how this works, right? Sometimes not enough syrup. Sometimes, actually no, I've never had it with not enough carbon. Actually I have, it's kind of flat. Let's see how KFC is doing today. Also, have you guys tried this Mountain Dew Sweet Lightning? Oh, yeah. So to test, down the hatch! That's a good soda test. All right. They went in it today. Also, what are you supposed to do with these biscuits, man? Well, it's like falling apart. Like, to me, a biscuit is not supposed to fall apart like that. But, like, they didn't give me no honey. Like, I don't know if I'm just supposed to do this. They give me no butter, no nothing. So I guess I'm going to have to make my own little Sammy here, right? But again, guys, you have to take these places with a grain of salt. Should I make it a ranch? We're going to make it a ranch sandwich. You have to take these places with a grain of salt. It's five bucks, five, six bucks. You get what you get. <laughs> and by the way, I told this story on Camilla's channel the other day, but I'll tell it on this channel. Oh, it's like a little McChicken. I love those little chicken littles. <whistles> What'd I say, McChicken? <laughs> Wrong fast food place, Lupe! All right, down the hatch. Here we go. Mm. Okay. Oh, see? That biscuit is literally just soaking up any kind of moisture. Sorry, I had to get a little soda in there for reinforcement. Jesus. All right. So my very first job, 
here's some trivia, guys. If we ever do, if we're Roadie Foodies ever in your town and we're doing like a meetup or a Roadie Foodie social, my very first job ever was at Carl's Jr. Sadly, the last time I went to uh, California to visit friends and family. I, I was, <clears throat> I wanted to go check out my own stopping grounds. I want to go check out my first job. It's not there anymore. It's like, um, I think they turned it into like an AM PM. So for, uh, see in Rhode Island, they don't have AM PMs. For anybody that's uh, not, I don't know if they have AM PMs other parts of the country or if it's just a West Coast thing. It's essentially just a gas station with like really cool, like, um, convenience store i don't know what you want to call it mm. the closest thing we have here in rhode island for that is uh, uh cumberland farms where you can go in they have every every damn soda ever made ever in the universe is there plus you can get slushies you can get things like that oh 7-eleven that's the closest thing too in Rhode Island, 7-Elevens don't have gas. Oh, actually, we do have one 7-Eleven that has a gas station in Cranston. So it's like that. That's how AM PM is. You guys know how I do with dry food, man. I'm struggling <clears throat> with that biscuit. Oh, momentum, blah, blah, blah. Ah, there we go. I don't know, guys. If I had to do a tender test... I don't know. Remember the last time I had Popeyes, it was it was uh, a little bigger, a little, little little meatier than that. It reminds me of the um, <clears throat> when Domino's and Pizza Hut were going at it, right? Just boom, 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 boom. But now Domino's is just killing it. Pizza, I can't even come close. Can't even come close. If you want to leave and if you guys want to leave a comment below saying that pizza is better than Domino's, let's start a lively conversation. I just, and I know you're going to be like, Luke, we know you eat a lot of fast food. Honestly, guys, I don't eat a lot of fast food. I started eating fast food for this channel. <laughs> It's a great problem to have because I'm like learning like new things. Like I had my first sip of like Baja Blast, I think like a month ago with Carissa. So, mm. oh, this is like really crispy at the end. It's almost like chicharron. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, there we go. Also. What is it about KFCs, man? When I go inside, I don't want to say that they're dirty. Because I don't think every single KFC is probably like that. But they're not. I, I don't want to say dirty. See, Loop, bring it back. Be positive. What's a positive way to twist this up? <clears throat> they need updating. It needs to be, the KFCs need to be. They need to be modernized a little bit. You have like Taco Bell, right? I mean, these guys come out with like new <clears throat> seating, new architecture outside. Like it feels like almost every 10 years, right? You go to some uh, Taco Bells now, even some like Wendy's, you're like, this is a lounge? What? what? Am I about to... <laughs> this is a VIP section? Do I need to... Is... Are we doing bottle service? <laughs> uh, can you imagine bottle service inside Taco Bell? Oh, I'm telling you, you're probably in a big tourist area. You probably get away with that. But we're going to Taco Bell Lounge near Chalupa with a bottle of Belvedere and a bottle of Grey Goose. I'm here for it. Mm. Also, I 
Have you guys watched the show? We mentioned it in uh, um, the video that Lindsay was in. A couple videos ago. Queen of the South. It's about a drug cartel. I haven't seen it yet. I'm trying to get like... You know, before you start a show, one of your friends is like, hey, you have to watch this show. You're like, all right, I need to hear it from at least three more people. I need I need references. I need someone else to co-sign this loan. All right, before, because what do we have in this life, guys? We have our time. That's an investment. So, before... What is that? Oh, mine's playing tricks on me. Mm. So before I invest my time on a show, because I'm a commitment guy. Look, what does that mean? Let me tell you. It means like even if a show is horrible, I'm going to follow through with it. One show that I'm really looking forward to, I think comes out next week, season two. Is, um, oh my god, I just had a tip of my tongue. Bad Boys? No, not Bad Boys. It's that superhero show on, um, on Amazon. Or is it Hulu? I don't know. These all, listen guys, we all cut the cord to save money. And now we're eventually going to end up spending more damn money. <laughs> we're going to end up spending more money on all these subscription-based apps. And I'm and I'm mad about it. All right, relax, Lupe. I remember the first day I cut my cable. Woo! I was like, "Yes, Lord, save me seventy bucks a month, close to a thousand dollars a year. What am I gonna do with this money? I'm gonna buy more food." So it was a wash. All right, let's get into this cookie. See if it's worth it. 120 calories. That's a lot, no? I don't know. I don't really count calories. <laughs> Regular cookie. Nothing really special about it. Uh, Colonel's chocolate chip cookie. Let's see if the Colonel would be rolling in his grave or he would co-sign this cookie. All right. You guys can see that. The thing I like about it is it's nice and soft, but I can't eat the rest of that, guys, because I need milk. When it comes to like chocolatey stuff, I need milk. I need my leche. All right. I wanted that sauce. So the kernel, guys, five forty nine in some areas. Honestly, I don't know if I got four five five forty nine on this deal, but. Uh, check them out. It's a new meal deal that KFC has. Um, we also want to hear from more more from you guys in the comments. Uh, you guys have been doing an amazing job. We try to get it. I think I'm batting a thousand. I think I'm batting a thousand replying to comments. So challenge me. More comments. Let's see if I can keep up. And again, guys, thank you so much. We're almost at 2K. 2K. All day. You thought I was going to yell right there. 2K all day, son. All right, guys. It's rainy. I needed to go out. Like, honestly, these mukbang videos are kind of like therapy. I was like, it's raining. I need to get the freak out of the house. Go online. What's a new, what's what's popping in, in the fast food world? Boop. Saw this meal deal. That's why we're at the Colonel's Casa. And, oh, Colonel's Casa. Great concept. A Kentucky Fried Chicken Mexican fusion cantina. People at the KFCs. <laughs> the hell's that? Why does why does it do that little bounce at the end? <laughs> Give Lupe a little bit call, Roadie Foodie. All right, guys, we love you again. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, we're almost at 2K. Thank you so much. We're at 20 plus more, and then we're all right. We just ordered B Love sauce online, so that should be coming any day now. 
Uh, and then we're gonna make our shopping list to do a our very first, our very, very, very first um, New England, uh, excuse me, we're gonna do like a clam boil. I think that's what it's called. Seafood boil? No, we're not doing like seafood. I think we're just gonna focus on clams, but use like be love sauce. We're gonna have like potatoes, eggs, uh, kielbasa. It's it, it's gonna be quite the treat. So I'm excited to do all that. Um, I was watching how to make be love sauce. A lot of butter. Hmm. Gonna <laughs> it's gonna be a one meal a day that day. Uh, so that day you guys are gonna see me devour that because I won't I won't eat all day to make sure uh, to be a little healthy. Um, uh, but like, comment, subscribe. We love you. Um, be well. Eat well. I don't even play it. I've always wanted to learn how to play the ukulele. Lupe, you have ADD. You need to relax. Okay. Ukulele. Like, comment, subscribe. Be well. Eat well. I got to turn my mask on my mustache here. Be well. Eat well. Sleep well. And take care of each other.